We got another package from Bustin' Snacks. Chocolate covered churros. Why do these taste like churros? Garlic baguettes. The churros get a good 10 out of 10, but them baguettes, I'm gonna have to think about it. Caramel Pringles. The baguettes are a solid five, but them caramel Pringles are a nine out of 10. The dang boss. All right, we just got to Denver Spice Kingdom and I heard that this place called CD's Wings makes some hot wings with ghost peppers, buffalo sauce, and red pepper flakes. We will have to go check it out. CD's, baby. Let's see what you're talking about. I will go ahead and take the no one left stand. I can never pass up fried pickles. Ooh. Then some jalapeno poppers. These are what the extra hot wings look like. Extra hot, no one left standing. No one left standing with no ranch. I'm still standing, baby. Thought they'd be a little bit hotter than that. I'm standing. I'm still standing even though my phone ain't. What's up, Spice Kingdom? I know it's super late, but look what I found in the gas station. This is a chamoy pickle. I've been looking for this forever. I'm just glad that I actually found it. Mmm. Bro, why are you always eating spicy food? Don't you know your fans care about you, bro? All right, I'm down to go to Burger King, but every single time I go there, they only give me three jalapenos. Can I have a spicy chicken sandwich meal? Can I please have a spicy chicken sandwich meal? Please add jalapenos on the sandwich. Yeah. They fries be busting on. Who? Before we even get into this, you go to Sonic. How many jalapenos they gonna give you? A handful. McDonald's. They don't even advertise jalapenos on the menu. They gonna still give you a good six or seven. Burger King. They gave me four this time. Burger King. Y'all better stop playing with me. Uber, now y'all know I've never taken you to a vegan restaurant before and I'm not vegan, but I love coming here for nachos and I'm about to show y'all why. Uh, no, I mean, come on, with all the ingredients that they have, this place was to die for. Mm. All right, all right, you win. Welcome back to snacks that I wish we had in the US. Devil chips. And we may have these in the US, I'm just not sure. Pink Oreos. They kind of look just like the Lady Gaga Oreos. 
And actually someone else recommended this to try and they said to shake it. Pretty sure you can get these in the United States. I couldn't find these anywhere. Smogs. Pretty sure it's safe to say that they just got better snacks. Macaroni and cheese ice cream. You go first, man. Wow, that is so weird. <laughs> yeah, it's busting. Invented the hot sauce syringe, the first solution for injecting hot sauce evenly throughout your burrito at the push of a single button. Using our proprietary multi stem technology, reach every corner with absolute ease. To begin, remove the top layer to create an easy point of entry. Then, grab the device and insert it firmly through the center of the burrito. Next, swiftly push the injection button to release a flood of hot sauce flowing between every ingredient. Now you can enjoy each and every bite perfectly coated in your favorite spice. The spiciest seafood I've ever had came from a place called Angry Crab. Let's see what the Juicy Crab top out. Number 12, which comes with lobster and snow crab, extra hot. Ooh, this one got eggs in it. We got some shrimps, but we ain't gonna peel it up. Some fresh lobster dipped in extra hot juice. They ain't a seafood boil if you don't got potatoes. Thank you, honey. Snow crab. Flavor, 10 out of 10. Uh, seafood is a little bit overcooked, but overall, I give it an eight.